At Fisher, we have many years' experience with Anker technology. We like to share our knowledge with the aim to improve safety standards within the fixing industry, from an initial specification and design to procurement, installation, anchor testing and final anchor certification. This can be done in two-way dialogue. Share your experience and any challenges with anchor specification and applications with us. Our training sessions can be made interactive. We can discuss your applications, answer your questions and go on this journey together, making sure the best practice is followed. It's not worth taking any risk. Make it right, first time around. So, what can we offer to you? Our technical training portfolio is vast. One of our extremely valuable training resources are CPD Continued Professional Development Accredited Seminars. They are a fantastic opportunity to discover more about correct specification of anchors, types and systems from the industry experts. You can choose from a vast range of topics and we will introduce these to you now. This seminar covers the basic principle of fixings. We explain the main criteria for correct anchor selection. We show you the latest innovations in anchor technology and various fixing solutions for many different building materials. This seminar will help you to address many frequently asked questions. For example, what is the best fixing for problematic substrates such as aircrete or hollow blocks? What anchors you specify when fixing close to a free edge? How to avoid splitting failure? Why resin anchors sometimes fail? Which resin systems don't require any hole cleaning and therefore are safer for use? What resin is specified for diamond drilled holes? What materials are suitable for different corrosion classifications? For example, what grade of stainless steel to be used in chlorine swimming pool environment? If you want to answer any of these questions, this seminar is for you. In this session, we will cover the consequences of incorrect design, selection or installation of anchors and share with you many difficult challenges from the real-life projects. You will see what can happen when anchors are overlooked. We provide examples where deviations from the best practice cause safety risk or even fatality. Important questions are asked such as why this happened and more importantly, how this could be avoided. After all, learn from mistakes and next time around, do it right. In this CPD, we share with you not only basis of anchor design theory in accordance with the latest Eurocode 1992 part four, but also promote better understanding of design methodology and anchor's behavior under different load conditions. Apart from the theoretical aspect of design, we also utilize practical testing videos, demonstrating visually different mode of failure and how different design assumptions can influence the performance of the anchors. How to determine the concrete cone resistance, for example. When splitting failure is decisive and when it should be considered. How metal shims influence the anchor design. Why alignment washers are sometimes required. How to design connection correctly under fire conditions. How fatigue loads influence design. Real project examples with value engineering utilizing Fisher design software CFIX is included. We show project case study demonstrating how to optimize anchor connections quickly and safely. This seminar provides introduction to very important code of practice for the selection and installation of post install anchors in concrete and masonry. It outlines the roles and responsibilities of the stakeholders, promoting safe use of anchors for safety critical applications. If you are designer, specifier, anchor supplier, anchor installer, supervisor or involved in anchor testing, do you know what are your roles and responsibilities to comply with this code of practice? Limit your liability, make sure you comply. The CPDs already presented cover the main aspects of anchor technology. We also offer CPDs for specialized subjects, advanced solutions for anchoring facade with undercut anchors. 
Here, in this CPD, we will introduce range screen principles, potential problems with traditional methods, advantages of advanced range screen cladding systems, and very nice project case studies. We also demonstrate that Fisher can provide full system solutions for your cladding applications, from connection of your panel to aluminium framework, connection to the wall with correctly selected anchors, and of course, we have the fire stop solution with our Ventistop. Aesthetically pleasing FZP2 anchors are introduced in more details. These sophisticated anchors allow hidden, non-visible connection of the facade panels and they are variable for different materials, offering flexibility in a design. Also, if you have a challenge, maybe do you need to fix floor-to-floor -floor aluminium systems? No problem, because we do offer also more rigid box section for verticals coming in different sizes so we can also design applications with these challenges. So in this seminar you will see fantastic product range and comprehensive full solutions for your end screen facade applications and of course all that is supported with a full design. Learning objectives are to raise awareness of the best practice in design and installation of passive fire protection systems. Role of fire stop, building regulations, how fire stop products work, typical products and systems, and how to avoid common and costly mistakes in service penetrations are included. For example, what are the allowable axial spacing for services? What are the maximum gaps around pipes for selected fire resistance? All these important questions are asked and explained so that expensive mistakes can be avoided and service penetrations in firewalls are designed correctly, eliminating the risk of the fire spread. The main objective in this seminar is to identify the risk posed by fire in facades and how to mitigate against them. Seminar attendees should gain better understanding of fundamentals of facade design under fire conditions, which is explained in detail, overview of relevant legislation, industry standards, and best practice for ventilated and also curtain wall facade fire stop applications. Case studies and installation examples are shown, followed by discussion and Q&A. Of course, we offer also bespoke, specially tailored seminars where we incorporate your suggestions and requirements. Join us on this journey, discover how to do it right and promote safety and best practice. Give us a call or register your interest online so we can share our expertise with you. Thank you for watching.